Hello and welcome back. I've decided I'm going to spin my original regenerative blower a little bit faster and see what kind of results I get. I'm outside because I'm afraid it's going to explode. So right here we'd be spinning at about 6,000 RPM. I'm going to hide here behind the door and hit the power button and see what happens. I tossed one of my previous blow meters on this unit as I was afraid it was going to explode and I wanted to get some sort of measurement before it exploded but just in case it damaged it I threw one of the other ones on. Okay so after testing it outside all seemed safe so I brought it back inside to test with the better flow meter. At 6000 RPM I'm getting a flow number of around 7 which is very similar to the vein pump. Alright, here we're going to do the pressure test again at 6,000 RPM and see what kind of reading we get. Watching this, I'm very convinced that that needle is moving at least just slightly. But, I don't know, I can't quite tell. But seeing the needle move at all is a bit promising. Alright, let's see what we can get. The motor spins at 1740 RPM. The pulley on the motor is three and a half inches, and I'm going to go down to five eighths on the pump's pulley, which should give us an RPM of around 9,700. So we're over 9,000, which I'll probably use as a meme in the thumbnail to, you know, get some extra clicks. All right, this is a little bit more what I'm looking for. Yeah, I'm definitely getting a good solid nine here, which is getting really close to what my vacuum cleaner puts out. Alright, here with the pressure test again, and I'm very happy to say I'm getting a good one pound of pressure here, and I haven't even sealed the case yet. Well, I'm going to keep this one short, so if you liked it, hit like and subscribe, and I'll be back for more. Have a good one, guys.